welcome Miss Laura Dern. Just as the art of acting is at its best when the audience is unaware of the technique, so the art of filmmaking is most impressive when the seams aren't showing and the persons who labor long and hard in scientific laboratories to put the art in the state of the art are the members of the scientific and technological community. In a special ceremony I had the honor of hosting last month, these behind the scenes artists and craftspeople honored their peers for the exceptional work done this past year to make the making of movies even more magical and manageable. Here are some moments from that special evening. Awards of merit were accepted by Panavision's president, John Farron, for their anamorphic lenses, and Manfred G. Michelson of Technical Film Systems for his ultra-high-speed film transport system. The highest technical award named for Gordon Sawyer this year went to a man whose achievements include developments in many fields, such as the camera crane controller, the high-gain drive-in projection screen, and the traveling mat system. The recipient was Petro Vlahos. I want to thank the Board of Governors and the Scientific and Technical Awards Committee for this Gordon E. Sawyer Lifetime Achievement Award. It has a special meaning for me because it represents a commendation by my fellow engineers and also because it honors the memory of Gordon Sawyer, a friend of many years and a pioneer in motion picture technology. Thank you. extends its congratulations to all the members of the scientific and technological community who have advanced the cause of filmmaking and been recognized with the Oscar. Thank you. Thank you, Laura. You know, the scientific and technical awards would have been brought to you live tonight, but we're experiencing technical difficulties. I'd like to take this moment to point out some of my friends who are with us tonight. Steven Spielberg and Richard Dreyfuss and there's Miss Houston. Hey girl, you know we don't have a statue for you here tonight. But you know what? I will always love you. You know? <laughs> Now you see why they only let me sing with nuns. <laughs>